previously on small tribes. How's he not dead? He's only got a fed suit, huh? He's dead? Holy go. shit! Did he kill Exmac? No, I don't think so. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god, and he's Mana. stacked! Mana. Bro. I just okay. killed one. Try and clean the mouth. Did they both leave or one leave? Well, I never seen any of them, they took all their turrets, so I chalked that up as a W, boy! Hey guys, hope all is going well for you, and welcome to another Small Tribes video. Today's video should be pretty eventful, there should be a fair bit of us being under attack, because that's all that our base has been. From the time the metal hit the ground, we've been under attack, just constantly, by different people, different tribes, just constant attack. Which is a giant pain in the ass when you're trying to do something, but you know what? It's fun! Leave a like, don't forget to tell me how shit I am in the comments. Don't forget to drop a sub if you haven't already, and share it with one of your friends so they can come talk some shit too. That's all I've got to say, let's get into it. That's not very good. Holy shit. I've got this stuff here to defend against him because Parasites took literally everything out of the base. He said he took the important stuff, but he literally took everything. <laughs> Lucky my boy he was fat. This feels disgusting. So I started building stuff back up, made it a little bit more defensible while I went off server. Went to get an exomech so I could actually craft some stuff. And I went and got an ammo box as well because I can't open the tech turrets at the moment. But if I drop shards into the ammo box they should put themselves in there. Then I'm gonna go look for some soakers to deal with and start looking to put some more heavies back up. I heard the guy boosting around again with his tech suit but he didn't try anything past this point. I did however learn something valuable off of him. In the first clip that you seen me punch the turtle, and I set the C4 off and blew myself up, in the moment where I seen the hatch frames crumble from the wall, I realised to myself, why are we even bothering to use hatch frames in the first place? Like, there's no reason to have them on hatch frames when the wall's that far back, and we could fit a lot more turrets in there if we don't use hatch frames. That was my new thought process going into rebuilding or refixing the base. Okay, so there's a few more soakers down there that belong to all different tribes, like literally every single soaker that was down there belonged to a different tribe. But I didn't bother to show up because I don't imagine you want to see me just chewing on soakers for ages. 
but thankfully for the Kano it didn't take too long. Now, these are only wild team Kanos or first gen Kanos for some of them, but they still make the world a difference against Soakers, so if you are a new tribe trying to start up, make sure that you get yourself a bleed animal. It doesn't have to be a Kano, but just get something. The reason that we opted for the Kanos is obviously because they're resistant to reds in this area, but they're definitely worth their weight in gold when Soakers are at your base. There we go. Rogue's just gonna have to deal with that when he gets on. So we managed to fit an Indie Forge up there, which I didn't think was gonna happen. And I went off to tame a Strider because we're gonna need to fill the existing turrets that we have left. And we're definitely gonna need to put up new ones. And obviously with dedicated storages, it makes it so much easier if you can just beam the resources straight back to your base. And at a time where we're constantly under attack, every couple seconds we can get help. Let's go. No, I just gotta fix all the fucking turrets. Fill in the gaps and shit. I need to do something about this too. Either that or these have to come back for. Why are you off? I turned it on, I swear. Obviously not. My bad. Is the XMAC blocking your way? Yeah, I'm just worried if I pull it out here, it might get stuck in it. Alright. That's all fine. Oh, wait. Can you just run it over the skip? Yes, I can. I was, I was just thinking of that after I started to cry up. There we go, got it. Do you want to hold on top of a skiff? And that's how we fucking do that. Easy. Yeah. I saw. Yo. I pitch wisdom for the kids, them solid as a prism, keeps the funky rhythm. If I want it, I go and get it. My blood thicker than water, we up like a zip of my jeans. Seems got ashes from the plane, I'm elevating and crashing in the bed. But instead, I hit my rooftop and watch the world go. Penning this shit inside my journal. Look up at the stars as I burn slow. Head to the veil over by Shrouds, we in the house with the herbo. As I throw on my starter, once my ignition startup is go time. And we ain't even hit our prime in no time. In the city living, spending past our limits. Put my all up in it, only play to win it What's the status quo, what's the scenario Kicking mad flavor as for hoes, we don't save a dough Put them to the side like a page of dough Cut them off clean like a tape of dough Really think you dream until you wake up though Everything is custom, if they don't want it, then fuck them If they ain't part of the process, can't trust them Double cup and sipping, bought a new row, eating true rows Shorty ass fat like a sumo, and I'm high off the you know Chilling with the crew, playing uno Niggas trying to front, but it's cool low We on our way up, so it's kudos. Trying to get the moolah copper too, though. I need a big crib with a blue nose. Step into my dreams like it's Euro. Playing pool with the cool vibes by the poolside. Shorty asked me what's my shoe size. She think I'm too fly, but I'm really too high. And I ain't with the rah-rah. Hit her and tell her bye-bye. Already got my nala. Young Simba in the flesh on the high ride. It's all about the commas and the dollar. Devils wear Prada. It's just another saga. It's just another saga. That's how I scared him. I never really understood that. Is that our skiff? Yeah. Okay, that is in a terrible spot. You just gave me a fucking heart attack. <laughs> oh, well, I gave myself a heart attack. I flew past it and the name didn't come you in. You just gave me like, a heart attack. What the f fuck? Oh god. <laughs> did, you get, shit myself. did you get that feeling where your heart just drops out your ass? I'm like, fuck me. They brought a skiff to raid us now. Open you. Freak. Open. Open. Fuck off. That'd be f as soon as we turn all the turrets back on. <laughs> Could instantly die. Just see a f***ing kill feed light up. <laughs> just watch him like watching us. Oh yeah, now back. we got some distance to play with out here. And now they'll be shitting themselves, because we pushed in you yeah. <laughs> They struggled to get through the door last time. God. How, wait, how far does that go up? Does it go up to the um, little hole? Yep. The little butt crack hole? Oh my god, we can put turrets right in the f***ing face of that shit. So I said, the big difference. How many triangles do you um, have? Doesn't matter what pace. Just keep f***ing smashing it. I just gotta find an angle where it's not cutting through, that's what it's going mad about. 
Yeah, look at that. Uneven, you know? Just the more press, um, just... Hmm. Symmetry, so when over. they blow in, they can fucking appreciate a build. Yep. Oh, hell yeah! Look at that! The walls. The doors. <laughs> nice. Okay, so after we finished putting our base back together, we had to get some more paste. So I grabbed a wyvern and head on over to Rag. Usually I would have used one of our chompy boys and just went and done missions and brought a bunch of paste, but at this time Parasite was currently using them. So that meant just doing it the old way. Oh, I can just not oh, shout. Hello. What was that? Someone's in here. Someone lives there? Yep. Whoa. Can we raid them? I need the paste. They may, they may have pace. They have a f***ing exo mech in here? Oh god, are they on right now? I would say so. It's all in the f***ing exo mech, surely it has to be. Is Why is it so cold in there though? What's this f***ing thing? Look, there you go. Well, that was oh, easy. Can you still move? You can still move. They got shit out. Yeah, they've only got 2k HP, they die really quickly. Or it could be them. Could it could be them, yeah. What the in the fucking PvE It's not even symmetrical! Oh my god. Trans under what? Why is it trans under foot? Oh, okay. Guess I know where I'm going out then. Next to a bob base, watch you get fucked by bobs. I will actually clip that and you will never live that down. I don't want to hear so it. You know. I've already had to rescue you from a stone base, I don't want to hear it. So while we were doing missions over on Gen 2 trying to buy up some stuff, we came across someone's terminal they'd put down to get the element dust out and it didn't really look difficult to get into so we thought, you know what, we have a massive shortage right now of shards. This might very well save us a fair bit of time if it works in our favour. So we decided to break into it. Shoot ones. You're doing like 500 per shot. Let's test the rifle real quick. Stop. The rifle's like just under 300. Keep shooting then. So we just cheese it boys. We get all the free alley. And all just whatever is in this f***ing XMAC. Oh, I can hear the comments right now. What? Oh my god, you're making a big deal out of cheese and something on Gen 2 for Element. It's like, yeah, well, it's Element I don't fucking have. It's how we don't have to farm. You know if you have Spyglass out and you look down at the ground, you can't hear a tech saddle shooting over your head? You can't? Huh? No. I can hear it here. The only damage that was hitting it was the splash, it's not hitting it. I can hit it though. Yeah, yeah. I can Is it? Am you're I hitting not, it? Yeah, no, you're not hitting it. I thought you said I was. No, I said no. What, what was in the way? Nothing. It's just not making the distance. Ah. Uh, uh, three, two, one. It's out. Easy. Oh, they, they had a lot. We weren't saving them. Oh, yeah. I, I didn't want to say because it's a Gen 2. I'd, do you want me to kill a fucking thing now? I'm just chucking them in the daddy. I don't kill yeah, them just yet. Just so they don't know. Oh, well, they'll know okay, anyway, so yeah. but like if they're not checking logs, they won't. Just pick all this shit yeah. up and chuck it back in here real quick. Holy shit, 4k, um... Like, element just sitting in the fucking... Jenny? Yeah, there's some dust oh, I see, in I here see the bleed already, effect. already created. Yeah, it bleeds out the bottom of them. It's fucking weird. Yeah. I like it though. I don't, I don't want them to change that. I quite like it. So we'd loaded up on element and was good for that for now. I started then to work on getting a reaper because I thought up there C spinning off the soakers would be really handy. But unfortunately guys, it didn't come quick enough. Because I'd gone to sleep and maybe got to sleep for four hours or so perhaps. And I was just kind of streaming the logs through my discord sitting next to me and then my girlfriend wakes me up. And I was as tired as shit too because I work full time as well. And obviously we'd been putting in the hours trying to get our base back to where it needed to be. But let me tell you this. When I heard those magic words that your turrets are going off, I sat up like the fucking Undertaker. I shit you not, 
and I flew down that hallway and it was on. Cop that, you little bitch. I don't even have the other f***er fab rifle over here, I'm gonna have to use a long neck. <laughs> Actually no, there's one. Be taking that. Bam that off again real quick. Where's this country at me from? Need a roof of turrets. That should keep that going for a little bit. Some bear traps, let's give this go. I'm gonna try stalker rush it now, right? Yes, 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 I was hoping that it happened. Thank God.
Gotcha, bitch. Thanks for the rockets. Might as well start getting some of the loot ready to dip if I have to. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. You're dead. Good night. Look, oh, it's cute. Can you bring my body back? You had the shards on you, do you? Yeah. Well, I, I just try to pull, um, knock him out. I wish you could pull the fucking saddles off him when they netted. Let it. Wait. Me. Okay, you know, I'll be on 17 seconds and I'll put shards in. Why is the shield down? I could, they're already in. They um, I want to bring them back up, but I had to pull it down because because they're trying to rock it. Here, grab this. Pick. Yeah, yeah, drop it. I'll uh, put Taras on only survivals for now. Yeah. This one should have already been on only survival. Why did it back on? Everything? Because I put them all onto players to kill the players. I know that you oh think. Oh my god. Yeah, I know we ain't hatch it now. Eat a fuck. They're gonna lose, they lost one of their stegos. Yeah, they've lost like a fucking army of them as it is. <laughs> I think our turrets are in our instinct. Shouldn't be, fucking like, he do Oh wait, no, no, he died. He died, he yeah, died, he died. it's because of the other survivors only ones. Apparently everything on me is ready to go instinct. I'm uh, I'm gonna put the fed suit away for you and then... Like you today, eh? He's dead, I just killed him. I don't know how you can able to hold up so fucking long, to be honest. Just doing what I can, I guess. Pretty much. Fucking turtle, man. They have way too much help. Just sitting at the door camping it. Boss about losing to Tush. They're just so cheap. You know? Mm. Can we grapple them into our base? Like, if, when they're trying to rock it, can we just grapple them? Off the front, you can, but it's very, very situational. Like, it's difficult as hell. Well, there goes another one. Oh, thanks. We can get that kit too. Straight to the oh, never realm with nice. you, my boy. Like right now, they're going to go get more shit. Yeah, they are. They're teleporting in now, left and right. Let's watch out for one of them sniping. She got take rifle on you. Just in case he hits me. We just pop me a miss timer. Put the shield up to ten real quick. Yeah, one second. Because then he won't be able. He won't okay. be able to snipe me. Surely their stegos are. No way these stegos get fucking get out. Surely. Oh wait, no, it's not 6x. Don't worry about it. I tried to build this one in a little bit. I'm gonna knock out my fucking car. Eh? It's got flak on. Come there. back in. Yeah. Sorry if stego gets in your way. Excuse me? That's there goes body. Just real quick, I wanna kill the other one. Oh, I gotta wait for my, um, Sego to stop, um... Yeah. My f***ing Kano is, um, gonna knock out. This Stego is gonna get me and I'm gonna be pissed off. I can tell you that. You got me? It's netted, but it's not netted. <laughs> Does that make sense? Oh, uh, can you grab saddles? I can't. Another, um, Stego? I really can't at the moment. I'm trying to get a turret behind him. Okay, yeah, yeah, all good then, all good then. Bob, uh, four seals down? Right. 
I didn't even pop it till not long before you got on. Oh, they told you in Meglo. What good is that gonna f***ing do? Uh, it's on aggro, I'm pretty sure. It's gonna block us from getting in. Can you net it? Stand back or you're gonna get netted again. Yeah, go. Can you net it, please? Okay, well there goes Kano. I had no fucking choice in that one. 144 saddle. Hello? If you can hold that, him, join me to got him like down him. a little bit. Thank for that. They want him just oh, he's... Yeah. Oh, she can get that body. Yoink. Oh, let's go. Uh, Force was also back up. I just netted their shit again. Get his kick. Guys, I'm gonna stop the video there real quick and explain what happened because unfortunately I don't have the clip for it. I've been recording clips instead of recording constantly from now on because it makes it so much easier for me to figure out what I was actually recording at the time and where it was. And it also saves a lot of space. Problem was back here, I was doing five minute clips instead of 10, so I missed a little bit of what actually happened. But basically earlier on in the video, I said I was gonna get a turret behind him and that's exactly what I did. There's like a miniature cave in the roof here. And I ran and jumped out there with the fed tech suit and spammed it down behind him and quickly put it in. One of them chased me because he knew what I was doing. What he didn't realize was though, is the generator reaches to up here. So he must have thought I was putting a bat turret down. Well, let's just say he realized at the last minute that it wasn't a battery turret and it was too late. Oh, God. There he is. Oh, he's, he's fucking molding, surely. Oh, he's fat. Oh my god! What a f***ing play of the century! Uh, this one, our uh, base is legit just a tip farm for us. Pretty much. You'll be defending this fish for two hours and think, holy shit. I said I've been there, I've been fighting them all f***ing morning. Uh, this is what I want to play, like, I just want to have fun, you know? Yeah, Not this like is sit at a base. Yeah, uh, I don't want to sit at some base on 1x where you've like, got to wait 12 f***ing years. To we do, didn't even try to get to in. To do anything, and then they all pull out anyway. They're actually demotivated now. They haven't come back. I don't know, they had a bassy over here on a cliff plat, so I'm gonna go over and have a look. Yeah, well... If I th I think they aren't coming back, I might just actually go farm points. They've packed up and they've left? <laughs> no! I How made them I made them sad! How? Oh my god, this base spot is overpowered. I'm oh. okay, we can't stop this thing, we gotta keep farming. That That's the funniest shit ever, can't. Imagine! Imagine the alphas and fucking leaving. Well, that's it, guys. They packed up, cracked the sads, and left. This was the most fun that we've had on Ark in a long, long time. Granted, it's pretty annoying that such a big tribe's bothering with a duo tribe. But hey, man, it is what it is. I did try to talk to them. Like, I had no intention of messing with them at all. Basically, was just trying to set up a base so we could go mess with other people. But that's just how Ark is. They had no intention of talking to me. So we had a bit of fun. And after this went down, we ended up pulling all of our stuff that was important out of there. Like, we left a little bit of things in here, but nothing that isn't replaceable. Because let's be realistic here, guys. They're going to pussy up and offline us. It's just how it is. They're not going to get in here online, obviously. So they're just going to bitch out and offline, for sure. Anyway, guys, I'm sorry the video ended up so long, but I, I didn't want to split it into two. Like, at the end of the last video, I promised this was going to be the video that showed everything. So I didn't want to just throw away the footage that I had beforehand. And I didn't want to just split it into two videos, because then I'd feel like I'm lying. Hopefully, you did manage to make it all the way through and if you did i appreciate you and i shall see you in the next video guys later